Hi, my name is Jada Sonica, and welcome back to my playthrough of Outlast. Spooky! It's super loud. It's super loud. I got the volume all the way up. Yes. Oh, that's right. I'm in a nut house. Perfect. So, on the last episode, Mr. Religion, with the very bad teeth, drugged me. And, and he, I passed out, and he probably did horrible things to me while I was unconscious. And then he threw me in the cell to save me for later. No, I don't know. <laughs> Remember, notes are only added to your notebook when your camcorder is raised. So I got a note... But I had a note last time! Rest in peace! Yay! It's such good handwriting for writing in blood. I mean, really. That's some serious penmanship for using blood. Hmm. What does it say? Streetcar. Who every day. Be confused. Oh. Hey, I'd like a pizza with extra cheese and pepperoni. What were the notes? Father Martin's cell. The priest, Father Martin, brought me in here to show me something. I bet he did. <laughs> Thinks I'm going to be a witness for whatever bullshit crazy he's trying to sell me. This Dr. Wernicke is at the center of whatever went wrong here. But he died more than ten years ago. Rest in peace, says the blood on the wall. Here's a little fun fact. I don't know why they named it Wernicke. Woo, the simple person. Um, but the Wernicke area in your brain, for anyone who knows anything about... Um, brain bits. Hi! <gasps> Hi! Why, thank you. Um, Wernicke's area of your brain, they're in my blood and they went out. Yeah. The Wernicke part of the brain is the part that controls your ability to speak. Somebody in there? Oh, I thought I heard somebody walking by me. I was like, ah! I hear creepy bad music. No more sleep. No more sleep. Cell block B. Sleep no more. Space alone. Leave me alone. I thought this was a mental asylum, because this looks like a jail, I would imagine. Lucky lucky. I mean even the fact that it's called block B. I mean, this looks like The Walking Dead. You know? This is like the jail that they lived in in The Walking Dead or something. Ew, he was just smashing his head on the wall. Okay, that was in my cell. What's that? Batteries on the floor. Alright. Is that batteries? No, it's a giant ass pill. I guess it's a depository. No more. Alone. Who's talking? They're in my blood if they want to get out. Him. You. Mr. Headbasher. Mm. Ooh. That reminds me of a scene from The Cave of the Mare that I was playing with a naked man. Hi. So, like, why aren't you screaming in horrible pain, mister? And what are you doing behind that door? Jerking like that. Can I get close to you or are you going to attack me? Can I dance with you? No? Eh <laughs> Whoa. Where's your other hand? What are you doing? Really? What's your other arm doing? Maybe that's your problem. Hi! Are you gonna hurt me? What? What is this? Somebody's viscera. 
Hi. And, and, and again. What the hell happened to his face? Holy smokes. Just like a rabbit. Or, or I don't even know what the hell. Yeah, there's there's something definitely wrong with these cell block people. This? Maybe Father Martin's man. Maybe. Hi. He looks nervous. I would like to kill him. As would I. The preacher asked us not to. It would be impolite. Not here. We give him a running start. There's an idea. And when we kill him, we kill him slow. Such patience. I want his tongue and liver. They are yours. <laughs> oh, you want my tongue and liver, do you? Naked twins. Totally naked. Just like... Yeah. Um... Congratulations on your endowments. So why aren't you... Hey! He pushed me away! How rude! Ah, uh, F. No more space. I can't see in here. I wonder if I can hide under this bit? Press left mouse button to hide. Left. Left. Okay, so I can hide. <laughs> I try to go in the warm door now. They're in my blood if they want to get out. Um. Heal. What, you just wanted to play peekaboo? I wanted to videotape you and all your mutated glory. He's banging his head again. So, so far, the only room I can hide in is that one. Sleep no more. Space. Alone. Leave me alone. It's like it's like modern art or something. I don't wanna you tape this. <laughs> oh, I can open a door. <gasps> and there's a crack. Boy, somebody got really excited just then. Good. Good to know. I'm looking for batteries, really. Hmm. Well, I already know about this game. So, ooh, look at you. How's that even possible? Um. You have no way to breathe. Yeah, it's like a Doctor Who episode. Sleep no more. Don't trust them. Space. I'll tell you, it's science. It's not. They were waiting for us. In Is this the guy that's place. talking? Billy understood. They've always been here. Yeah, it is him talking. Um, I don't know. If you peeled They're off blood, if they want to all your off. skin, Heal. it might puff up like that. I can hide in this room too. Good to know. So there's lots of rooms to hide in, which leads me to believe that I'm going to have to hide at some point. Ooh, this one's lit up. Such a shiny, happy room. I want to go in there. So, they want to eat my tongue and my liver. Are they still there? They're still there, waiting to eat my liver. 
Yes, you are. What does that say? God annoys... Or always provides a way. Follow the blood. Aren't they pretty? Naked twins. Don't push me around, mister. I'll push you around. Push you. Push you. Push you. Push you. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> so, I don't know how. I guess I go through the crack of the wall? Like Alice? Through the looking glass? level as those bad men. So <laughs> God damn it! What the fuck is the matter with you? You weren't invited to this, you goddamn it! Go! You like to watch? It's sick. You're sick! I'm not the one with my pants down. Uh, making sweet love to a neck headless body. Um But, you know, go ahead and carry on. Um I hear bad music. Dowd brothers aren't there anymore. Apparently they want to eat my tongue and liver. Good old country boys. Are you alive? I would guess that would be a no. But I thank you for your battery. That was your last um, thing to hold on to. I guess. It's down there. Bars everywhere. This does not seem like a mental institution. <sighs> but they did say that Mount Massive were pig poos, right? So to get on the ledge, just move towards it. No more. Okay. Space. Alone. Leave me alone. Um. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to. There are bad people over here that, that want to eat my, my liver and my tongue. Oh, you guys will wait until I finish. But I saved some for you. Um. Save somewhat. Is that the guy that was having making sweet, sweet love to that corpse? And the naked twins have disappeared. How lovely for me. Oh, this is the other end of the naked twins. Is he having a good old time still? No. Yeah, he's got no pants on. So, um, Follow blood trail to the exit. What the hell is this wall made out of? Mm, block A. Um, this this does not make me very happy to be here. Um, I'd, I'd like to thank everyone for being here, but, um, uh, go to hell? I'm... Mm -hmm. It says follow the blood. And then there's blood over there. And then there's... 
saving the down the drain. Down the drain. Well, that's good to know. I guess I'm going down the drain. But not before I read this handy dandy file. A document. Necromaniac. Fuck this place, seriously. Just fuck this place. Dying keeps moving lower down the list of the worst things that could happen to me here. I tend to agree. Father Martin. Finger painter. From... A really weird email address. To a weirdly weird email address. Patient art program. Patient Father Martin. Archmabod Helen. Dr. Scheiner gave me your info to contact regarding the cancellation of the arts program. My patient Martin Archmabod has made enormous strides in his therapy on account of his finger painting. Just in the week since cancelling the arts program, his schizophrenic, oh, schizoaffective assertions of some higher calling have accelerated enormously. Please just let the man finger paint. The Father Martin crazy person is a finger painting schizoaffective person? Okay. The few dollars you're saving on temper paint is more than swallowed by the cost of clozopine. I can't imagine the logic at play here unless Murkoff wants our patients to become more disengaged from reality. Please advise Dr. Neil Wolfram. Okay. Again, with the, the symbols. What is with the symbol player following me around everywhere? It's weird. Do you have any battery for me? No. Yes, I hear you. Down the drain. Down the drain. Down the drain. Didn't I come up? No, I came up an elevator. I scared. Ooh, there's a spooky room in here. Am I going to find a scary man? Probably. I wonder if the elevator goes. And there's a door here too. Ooh. So many choices to make. Um, I said follow the blood. That's locked. Closing doors behind you will slow attackers. I need to know this information because someone's going to chase me and try to rip my head off and then Make love to my rotting corpse. Is that it? Um, it is potentially dark in here enough to hide. I think. They weren't experiments. They were rituals. A conjuring. Hmm. So this goes nowhere. These blue bottles look like um, batteries, but they're not. Yeah, I, I don't. This looks like a prison. This doesn't look like a. Would you like to come out and play? No? Look at you! You look almost normal! Okay, so... Somebody's gonna chase me down that hall, I would guess. And then I shut this door. And then I hide in a locker or the cell. Can you get into this locker over here? Yes, okay. I would at least guess that that's what's going on. Because it told me that shutting doors slows pursuers. So. That would imply that I'm going to be pursued. Just shut up! Let me think for a minute! Quiet! Uh, uh, quiet! Uh, uh. Uh. 
Somebody having a good time in there. Yeah, I, I would be freaking out a little bit too. There's lockers there too. Maybe, 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 maybe I'll scratch. Scrounge. Scrounge. I see a head there. There's cells and lockers over there. Baseball bat, man. Um. Well, I'm not gonna be able to get by. So, peekaboo. Hi. Are you gonna chase me? No. Hi. I'm gonna take a picture now. You chase me? Seem like you're looking right at me. No? I assume you're gonna try and hurt me at some point. Because why would you... Yeah. But I guess I have to go past this to activate you. So, um... Run. Boop! No? Boop! Now you're gonna chase me? I'll be as quiet as a church mouse. Are, are, are you gonna chase me or are you worked? You, you just bashed that. Ah! Get you are back. gonna chase me. Okay. Fucking don't know where I'm going. Is he chasing me? Ooh. Everything got all wobbly. What time is it? It's only 9.20 at night. For reals. Dude is in this place until the morning. And it's only 9.20 at night. Okay. So, dude just likes to whack his stick in the office? Is that it? Can I just walk by? I'd like you to stay quiet. I'll stay quiet. Okay. Um. Fuck you. <laughs> that wasn't stay quiet, was it? Um. Oh, shut up, you camera. <laughs> You know, you would think that he would be like, Oh, you know, there's crazy people in this place. Maybe I should turn my shit off so it doesn't make noise. Is that a folder? Clicky, clicky, clicky. No. Why doesn't he just hang up the phone and then he could Look at my shadow. Ooh, I've got a shadow. I've got a double shadow. That's really good game craftsmanship. Because there's two light sources right there. Yeah, these clocks seem to be keeping real time. Hmm. If the other clock still says 920, I'm going to be so disappointed. Look at the shadow. Okay, so I'm in this room. And the only reason to come in here is to either hide or get a battery. Soki. Hi. Can I videotape you now? Ooh, look at your pretty face. You can be a model. You're not wearing any shoes either. Don't you know it's dangerous to walk around and not without any shoes? And, and since you're borked, apparently, I'm just gonna like walk around. There's a door here. It's very ominous. Oh, this is the naughty bad man. That's a man. That's a bad man. That's a bad man. That's a bad man. That's a bad man. That wants to get my booty and beat 
me with a stick because he hates me. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Get in the locker, man. Get in the locker. Thank you. So it wasn't the man that likes people to be quiet. Oh shit, is he gonna open my locker? No, don't open my locker. You don't want to. Nothing in here. Just some dirty gym clothes, some socks, you know, like maybe some smelly sneakers. You don't want anything in here. Totally don't want anything in here. Mm -mm. I like how they make my person breathe harder when he's scared. Totally forgot what my person's name was. Don't know. But I guess Mr. Stick is gone. Yeah, Mr. Stick is gone. But, um, if Mr. Stick is going to chase me, is Mr. Stick in here? No, it's still just him. If Mr. Stick is down there, I like you to stay quiet. Is he um, patrolling now? Is that it? If I just sit here and wait, will Mr. Stick go walk across the other side of the world? And like. How do I... Can I trap Mr. Stick in here while I do my business in the other room? And why is this stick man not... Please avoid contamination and wash your hands, even though there is no sink here. I don't know. Mr. Stick in there? Mm, no Mr. Stick. Good. Well, let's just not push the big flashing button before we take a look around, shall we? Oh fine, shut up you. I don't know where they get these batteries from, but they really suck. Does this show where Mr. Stick is? No. Follow the blood. Um. Moink! Um. Let me hide now, players. Because I'm sure Mr. Stick will be back. Because. Pushing buttons seems to cause them to always show up. Mm -hmm. Mr. Stick came back. But I know he would. But I'm disappointed in the violin players. I didn't hear any violin bumblebees. <gasps> Got my finger on the run button. I don't like your games. I've seen what your games are, you and your friends. And you might like to chop people's heads off and have a little party in their pants. But I, 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 don't, I don't think I want to go to that party, okay? He was breaking in a door. So now he's patrolling? Follow the blood. Mr. Stick going away. Watch, I'm gonna turn this corner and he's gonna be right there. Thank you, Mr. Stick. 
and there is something I'm going to hide in now because I don't trust this game. Something on here is footprints. I hear somebody screaming. Afraid of Mr. Stick. There must be side on this side. Mr. Stick. And where are the endowment brothers? This is not proper. I could call them the penis pals. I follow the blood, and I turn something on, but how do I get there? I don't know. Am I supposed to push any buttons in here? No, I don't think so. Where is Mr. Stick gone? Guy's gone too now. Oh my god! The clocks in this game are seriously telling real time. That's so freaking awesome. That is really awesome. I know, I'm a nerd. Whatever. <sighs> well, th with this guy gone, I can look and see if there's any goodies over here for me. I don't know what that viscera is supposed to be. It looks like an entire inside of a button. Maybe the intestines? I don't know. Ooh, they might be making bloody footprints! Oh, I hope I'm making bloody. I am! I'm making bloody footprints! Ah, oh, that's so awesome! I wanna play in the blood! I wanna play in the blood! I wanna play in the blood! I'm making bloody footprints! I don't know where he went to, and I don't want to know. I'm gonna hide here now. No? So totally telling real time. That is so awesome. I'm so excited about that. Ooh, what's this? <gasps> I'm gonna take a picture. That's so pretty. That guy's scary looking. Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. And you know what's crazy about this kind of stuff? I was at um, a hospital in Buffalo, New York one time. And I don't remember what it's called. It was like Buffalo General or something. And, um... Follow the blood. Ha! <laughs> Am I safe? Probably not. Anyway, um, they had all these creepy old pictures on the way to the cafeteria, because I was visiting somebody there, but on the way to the cafeteria, they had all of these pictures. Oh my.
Hi. You both actually look like orcs. I would die if that actually had opened. You both literally look like orcs. I keep looking at <laughs> No batteries for me, but I can play in some more blood. Let's see, can I? I can! I wish I had a club. Why can't I have a club? Um. I can strafe left or right. If I strafe this way... Aren't the, the happy little... Endowment twins gonna grab me or something? I know they are. They, they have to. Because they're right freaking there, aren't they? Um. <coughs> um. They, 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 they were just. Um. Okay. But there's not really any place in here to hide. Oh, but there's a battery. Save me, trusty battery. This is very weird because there's brand new looking computers, right? I mean, the chairs don't look all that clean. But these computer screens and keyboards are spotless. And this console here looks spotless. I can hide under there. Woo! Not really. Um, so there's no place to hide in there. There's another dead man. Um, um, is this gonna make something happen? I would like to read the document, but I'm a little nervous. So I'm just gonna like go over here where nobody can see me, I hope. And then read the document. Purge Gate Maintenance Memo. Murkoff Corporation. Proper purge gate maintenance is crucial to Project Wall Rider security. Please refer to Murkoff Corporation Maintenance Manual blah blah or seek guidance from a supervisor with a proper security clearance. Do 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 da do Hmm I don't think we have any supervisors left in the simple player again. <laughs> do I control the simple player? I do. Maybe my notebook is actually symbols. Like, either side of my notebook is actually symbols. I can hear them whacking something. Mm. 
why are there decontamination thingy bobs? I'm trying the door. You, hey. No door. Where did the endowment brothers go? Do I want to know? Probably not. D block. Um, can I hide in these? No. Can't hide in those either. Dark is it over here? Pretty dark. Dark enough? I don't, I don't know. Maybe. I'll be quiet as a church mouse. Exit through the showers. This is under storm. I was What? I was supposed to do that. I, I was I was I was supposed to, to jump out the window? down and jump, you know? The ground doesn't look that far away. Oh, we're going to stratify this way and see. Because um, it doesn't seem to have done anything. So apparently I just magically knew what to do. I was just bad music going down. That was weird. Um, um, boop! <laughs> I'm gonna take my little file, okay. And I'm gonna go into this nice cell. And, and I'm gonna shut the door. I'm gonna go hide in the dark over here and read it. Dr. Wernicke death certificate. Please find attached copy of the death certificate of Rudolf Dr. Wernicke. Murkoff. Psychiatric system subcontractor number yappa yappa. No surviving family. State of Colorado. Hold your light to view watermark. <sighs> Rudolf Gustav Wernicke. Wernicke. Length of residence in the city or town where death occurred. Zero years, seven months. How long in U.S. if foreign birth? 55 years. Sex, male. Color, race, white. Single, married, widowed, or divorced. Single. Date of birth, 1918. Date of death, 2009. Hmm. So he was pretty damn old. What would that be? Let's see. It would be 8291? He's 91? Damn. I hereby certify that I attended deceased from June 4th, 2003 to February 2009. I saw him alive on February 2009. That death occurred on the date stated above at 4.11 a.m. The principal cause of death and related causes of importance were as follows. Heart failure due to advanced age. 
This is to certify that this is a true and correct copy of the official record. Banicky. Yay, symbol maker. Symbols. Okie dokie, so old guy was ex an old German guy. Was experimenting on people. Anybody in there? Oh. I've got batteries. Ew, I just noticed just now that it tells me how many batteries I have. That's pretty funny. Well. That looks painful. At least you still have your head, though. I, I want to I want to play in your blood. I'm sorry. <laughs> I could draw flowers in their blood. That's so cool. Wow, and again with the viscera. Well, if the other one was intestines, then these are really full intestines. That looks like a lung though. That looks like a colon, arm, and a head. But he has his bits, so. Now, what the hell about this chair? This looks like a pooping chair. Pooping <gasps> chair, pooping chair. Oh, that's so cool. The straps move. Did they move? It looks like the straps moved when I went by it. I don't know, maybe it's. It's like a window. Mirror, maybe. I don't know. This must be the rest of the parts for that. Except there's three legs there. So, something wrong here. So, why did I come in here? Just for that file. Mm, maybe I can. No. I don't know. I don't know where the hell I was going. Um, head towards the light. There's a piece in the light. This is a really dark room. Oh, this is where I came from. Yeah. Okay. Sure, I was down here. Yeah. Okay, I was down there. So I want to go to the right. I'm gonna run into the endowment brothers, probably. Can open this now. Hmm. Can I go in? I can't believe that he slams doors. I mean, that's so stupid. Mm hmm So I push the button and all hell breaks loose, right? This looks just like that other room. Like, literally. Ooh. I thought that was... Okay. So this is the same hallway. Battery! Mine, no. So this is inactive. Okay, so. That's where I want to go. I'm guessing. <sighs> that I push the button and some naughty bads come and chase me. Pigman. Pigman wants 
to eat my liver. Shit. Shit. Run. Ah. Fuck. Run. Ah. I can, I can jump in here. No. Fuck. Ah. Run. No. 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 <laughs> I videotaped him killing me. <laughs> Yay. So, um, shit. Where do I go? How do I get out? I can't get out. It's locked. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? All the doors are locked. What do I do? What do I do? I don't know. What do I do? Fuck, fuck, fuck. fuck. I don't do that. What do I do? I, I, I just run him a merry chase. Ow! Do I push another button? No. Fuck. Ow! Get off. Get off. Get off. No. Oh, you're so pretty. He ripped out my heart, I think. So I don't understand what I do. If all the doors are locked, um, all the doors are locked. I don't understand. All of the doors are locked. I can't get out. I screwed myself. I can't get out that way. I don't understand. I can't get out that way. Just play run around the mover bush? No. Um, this is gonna be like the hunter. Ah! Oh shit. Shit. Jump and run and go. Oh my god. Go, please. Go. You can't get in here with me. You're too fat. Screw you. You're too fat. You can't get in here. Can you? No. But I'm kind of afraid jump down now because that was really scary so um, I'm gonna end the episode here if you liked it please hit like and subscribe and come back and see what happens don't forget to drink my bell <laughs>